The next speaker is Herbert Dobkin. Could I have a hand mic, please, too? Uh, thank you. Uh, good morning. I'm Tony Depkin. I live in Chestnut Ridge across from Dallas Highway uh, and uh, across Dallas Highway from OB80. First, I want to thank the Board of Commissioners for voting down five to nothing the original Z80, uh, Z98 plan in May. And I encourage you to do the same for the new plan, OB-80. I'm going to be presenting a number of engineering considerations. I even have a three-dimensional model of the critical space, which is right behind outlet, outlet, outlot number two. And I'd be happy to show it to you or discuss these things further with either you gentlemen or someone who you designate. Uh, I'm, I've also been down and we've talked with the uh, Cobb <coughs> DOT uh, engineers and uh, someone else will talk about that in more detail. Okay, could I have the uh, first picture there? Okay. Uh, this is a picture of Z98 right here. The red line is residential. 77% of the perimeter of Z98 is surrounded by residential. Just this black line over on the side is the commercial area, which is, as everyone knows by now, Taco Max, a strip mall, and a huge Lowe's. Notice everywhere else is residential, Garrison Ridge, Heritage Oaks, Heritage Oaks, Three Houses, and Cher uh, uh, Chestnut Ridge. Now, you've already heard that 90% of all the people <coughs> in these three developments <coughs> signed petitions against uh, uh, Z98 and for any commercial development on that lot. 2% were for it and 7% either we couldn't reach or abstained. Uh, now, um, any commercial rezoning of OB-80 uh, is not consistent with the county future land use plan. And uh, I want to show you again the perimeter here. 77% is residential. Now, re residential housing could easily be built on OB-80, and we, pre we repeatedly told uh, Commissioner Weatherford, Skip Gunther, and Columbia that we would consider any residential development, including RSLs, and our requests were not honored. Uh, I'm a retired engineer with 40 years of practical experience, and I have Columbia's latest drawings, if I could have the second figure up, and uh, <clears throat> this is very much a uh, non-professional engineering drawing, but it really does show the points. Unlike Parkside, which is a relatively flat uh, 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 land, OB80 is a very steep hill. And I can show you that very readily here. This is a, a drawing. This is the height of the land. This is a side view, and this is west to east. Here is the present slope of the land, this line right here, the dark line. What will happen is this is the uh, finished product according to the Columbia drawings. I have them here if anybody wants to look at them as well as the model. And uh, <clears throat> this is after blasting, and blasting will definitely be required, and lots of it. Uh, and this is before blasting. About <coughs> 400,000 tons of uh, Rock and dirt will have to be moved from here to there. And according to Columbia's borehole drawings, on their drawings, they will have to bore in many places, the deepest bore being 42 feet. That's four stories high worth of rock. It's like cutting a, a cut on a big highway. This is not small scale. 500, sorry, 400,000 tons, 20,000 truckloads. Most of the dirt, however, will probably be moved, they'll probably have a rock crusher on site to move the rock from here to put it there. To make a long story short, um, uh, they will cut the east half of the hill away, or 
dollars from here to here. That's right through the top of the mountain, 1,100 feet right through the top of the hill. Not one side, not one foot or the other, right through the top. And they'll fill in this valley over here. This is 995 feet to get the average of 1040, which is their plan. I can show you the drawings. Okay, could I have the uh, next uh, slide, please? And this is the last one. Are we going to get it in or not? No. Okay, we, we'll, 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 we'll do it this way. This is a photograph. Mr. Duncan, your, your time has expired. Okay, may Thank I you. make the conclusion? This is the before and after view of the blasting. This is a 30-foot cliff over Dallas Highway. Thank you, sir.